Oh. Oh, there you guys are. Welcome to Funko's Vaulted, episode four. Hey everyone, welcome back to the Nerdy Collector, and today, I'm bringing you Vaulted Episode 4, all the Funko Pops that have been vaulted this month of March 2018. We've got quite a few stuff being put into the vault here, quite a few pops, some good ones, some ones that you I can understand why they're vaulting. So let's waste no time, let's get through this list of the pops that have been vaulted. Coming in at number one is Mrs. Potts and Chip. Now this is from the cartoon version of Beauty and the Beast. Uh, my girlfriend actually has this pop twice, I bought it for her and my fr her friend bought it for her as well. So uh, she has this twice, so I probably will take one of them now it's been vaulted. Um, yeah, cool pop. It comes with the small little chip cup and Mrs. Potts. And as you can see in the picture, she's a quite a nice looking pop. So she has been put into the vault. Then from Flash, we've got Captain Cold. He has been vaulted as well. So um, if you're a Flash fan, make sure you get out there and pick up your Captain Cold because he's gone now. No more Captain Cold. Then we, then we have this true Scottish hero. We've got William Wallace from Braveheart. Now, if you like that film and you like that character, Definitely get out and pick yourself up a William Wallace. It'd actually be quite a cool pop to have in my collection. I've never actually seen it to pick it up, but if I did, I think I might snap that up. So if you were interested in William Wallace or Braveheart is a film that you like, or you're Scottish, get out there and pick up that pop. That they may take our lives, but they'll never take Oh, We've also got from South Park there, Mysterion, which is a cool pop as well. I only have one South Park pop, which is Cartman um, with Clive. And uh, yeah, it's a cool pop. Like I said, South Park's a good show. But if you're interested in that one, make sure you pick him up. And then we've got a dog here, a dog pop from a game called Fallout. And it's Dog Meat. He's another pop that I, these aren't really pops I'm uh, really into, but he, he has now been vaulted as well. So if you are into that pop, it's up on the screen. All pictures will appear on the screen as you've already worked out because you've already seen them all. Don't even know why I'm bothering telling you. But there's Dog Meat and he is now in the vault. Another pop that's been put into the vault is The Walking Dead Carl Grimes. It's a Carl Grimes pop when he was younger and he's got his um, sheriff's hat on. He's holding those keys from when he was in the prison. So Carl's now gone. Um, and he's been in the vault. I have the Carl in the poncho, which I think is a much better pop. And uh, I won't be getting this one. But if you are a Walking Dead fan, you want to collect all those pops, make sure you get out there and pick up Carl because once he's gone, he's gone. And on the same note with Walking Dead is a pop that I have actually been looking out for. It's Herschel Green. He's now been vaulted. I would definitely like this pop. Herschel's a great character in that show. And it's something I'd definitely think of picking up. If I, if I saw it, I'd definitely get it. And I'm going to Comic-Con in May. So that's the sort of place where you're going to find these pops. Hopefully for a good price and I'll definitely pick up Herschel. From Game of Thrones we've got Melisandre who is the uh, the Red Witch. She is um, a brilliant character as well in Game of Thrones and um, another Game of Thrones pop I don't actually have and I have seen this one many times and I've passed up on it but next time I see it I'm going to pick it up because I want a complete Game of Thrones collection. I know it's going to be near impossible because it's so hard but this is definitely one I'd pick up. As you can see Night's Watch hoodie, massive Game of Thrones pan. Pan? Massive Game of Thrones fan, and um, it's something I'll definitely be picking up. Make sure you pick it up in the daytime, though. Don't shop for it at night, because... For the night is dark and full of terrors. Another Disney pop now, which is Sebastian from The Little Mermaid, the little Jamaican crab from the uh, uh, Mermaid films. Like, again, a great little character. I don't actually collect that many Disney pops, so I don't actually have this one. But um, a great character nonetheless, and you're probably best off, and you'll probably be able to find him best. Um... Under the sea. We got we got a Space Jam pop now in Looney Tunes with Marvin the Martian. Uh, he's dressed up as a referee when he refereed that basketball game in Space Jam. If you haven't seen Space Jam, check that out. Such a great film. One of my childhood favourites. But Marvin the Martian's one of the great Looney Tunes characters and Where's the kaboom? There was supposed to be an earth-shattering kaboom. And if I ever did see this, I'd definitely pick it up. I do see Space Jam pots, but unfortunately just not this one. We've got a character here called Elliot Alderson from Mr. Robot. I'm not really familiar with this TV show, uh, but that has now been put into the vault as well. And they've also put the Elliot Alderson Chase. I have seen this at my local comic shop, Place in Space, in Croydon. Check them out. And um, that he's got his hood up. So his hood is up. So his hood's up in the uh, chase, which is uh, makes it the chase. And that's also been vaulted. So the regular one and the chase have been vaulted. So if you're a fan 
fan of Mr. Robot. Uh, let me know if I should check it out, if it's any good, because I've never seen it. I don't know if it's a film or a TV show. I've known nothing about it. But let me know in the comments below if you're going to pick them up. Also, we've got a blue haired character here called Jinx. I'm not really sure what she's from, as I'm reading this from my phone, and it's a very blurred picture on the top of the box, and I can't actually see what she's from. That's terrible by me, because I'm making a video. But nonetheless, I don't know the character. She's been vaulted. Let's move on. For all you little bronies out there, you're going to be very disappointed, because Rainbow Dash has now been vaulted. She has gone. Uh, he, she, I don't know. I don't watch it, but it's gone. Um, another pony popped down in the vault. Uh, we've got an NFL player now called Marshall Lynch. Really, again, don't know nothing about him, but um, he has also been put into the vault. And we've got Alice as well from Alice and the Looking Glass. And um, I think that's what the film's called. But Alice and Alice in Wonderland, but the real life version, the Disney live version. And uh, I've got Time, who is in that film as well, played by Sasha Baron Cohen. I got that, if you check out my Mystery Funko Pop unboxing, I got that in there. And you can see what else I got with it. But I don't collect them. I gave it to my girlfriend. But if you're interested, Alice has now been involved. We've got Grover from Sesame Street. He has now been followed also. Grover is uh, no longer. So if you're a fan of Sesame Street, make sure you pick him up. We've got Brian O'Connor as well from The Fast and Furious. He is also gone. We've got Nick Wilde from um, Zootropolis, which is a great movie, by the way. Um, he has now been vaulted. Uh, we've got Ray with lightsaber from The Force Awakens. Um, that is a pop that's probably very common and easy to pick up, but it's now been put in the vault. We've got Beef Squatch from uh, Bob's Burgers. That has now been put in the vault as well. And another NFL player called Antonio Brown. And yet another NFL player called Jason Ritten. Then we've got some pet pops. We've got the French Bulldog and the Beagle. They have both been put into the vault. So sad day for dog lovers, but they quite a few dog pops have been put into the vault this time. We've got the masked version of Deadshot from Suicide Squad, and he's been put into the vault. We've got Cuba from, he's like a game character thing. He's in Pixels. He's a big part of that um, film as well. So Cuba's in the vault. We've got the li Liquor from Resident Evil. This this is actually a really cool looking pop. I don't know, I've never seen the film, but the pop looks actually really cool. Something like, it's just something really different. So it's really uh, got its brain out and its big tongue. So it does look really cool. We've got the Chocolate Labrador Retriever as well. Another pet pop there has been gone in the vault. And then another French Bulldog Grey. They make a lot of these dog pets pops, they really do. Um, we've got Gaston as well from Beauty and the Beast. This is the animated Beauty and the Beast one. I actually am interested in getting this pop because he is a character I do like from Disney. So I, I've seen this a lot and I'm definitely going to snap it up now before the price goes through the roof. But they're putting this whole wave of um, Gears of War stuff into the vault. So that will all be shown on the screen as I'm speaking now, but they're, they're all gone. And lastly, guys, we are getting Maurice from the Planet of the Apes films. One of my favorite characters in those films. Those films are fantastic. These are the new reboots of um, Planet of the Apes. I actually do have Maurice. So he's a great character as well. So thanks for watching this video guys, I really appreciate you sticking through this to see all the stuff that's been put into the vault. There's Hopefully there's no, nothing I've missed, I've tried to gather all the pops that were put into the March vault. So um, yeah guys, let me know what you think and which ones are the pops you'll be picking up from this collection or eager to look out for that now they have been vaulted. And stuff that you were probably going to get anyway but now it's been vaulted you're definitely going to pick up. Don't forget to hit that like button guys and show me your support for this video so I can keep doing these vaulted um, videos. I really do enjoy doing them. And don't forget, like I said, to comment. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram, links in the description below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button, guys. I really do appreciate every single one of you that subscribes. And um, if you're already subscribed, hit the notification bell. And like I said, if you aren't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. So thanks a lot, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.